and they were launched to the press and they were filmed in all sorts of different situations and there were lots and lots of rumours about the CBC cars they were built and then stripped and then built and then stripped again these were all the CBCs were registered in the August of 94 and the P38 didn't officially get launched until the November 94 at the Geneva Motor Show there's only 19 CBCs left that we know of and one of them is uh, owned by a mate of ours who's got the one that escorted Princess Diana's funeral procession. Um, there's quite a few that are still police cars or marked up as police cars. This is 269 and 270s in the Dunsfold collection. Same colour, same car just about. It's always nice to know that the history is, is all there and not being lost because so many vehicles uh, may still be around. But we don't have history behind it. Um, yes and no. It's taken a lot of members, a lot of work, a lot of time to get it up to this standard. Um, my son does most of the body work and the mechanics on it, but Paul from Atkinson Engineering, he's done a lot of work on it, and it's sourcing parts. It's all genuine. There's nothing copied on it. Everything's as it would have been when it came out of the factory. And that's the way it's got to be, it? It is on this one, that's the way it's got to be. That's really the thing for bringing it on. It's moving along. Got a slightly different vehicle here. Pinky! It's gone all shiny now. So, so for obvious reason, you also like the, the colour pink. pink. Well, she's got a slight story. Um, she was my mum's car. And, um, yeah. my dad was in the car. Lovely story. She's full of sentiment. So, yes, that's really good. And, and you're going to carry on loving it and yes, looking after it. Yes, definitely. Never going to stop loving it. And you still love the colour pink. Love the colour pink. Fantastic. Lovely, lovely story. Have you, sir? Well, if you look at the name on the side of the car, it's, it's a brown one. Only about 25. It's a dealership in Scotland. So, quite special. Yeah, one, this is one of 10 because it's a petrol. And what, what was the difference on this too? It's just the spec in the steering wheel and the lap guards and the side step, the colour, lap and uh, no sunroof, the four inch bed, basically. And the picnic tables and the PlayStation in the back. And it's still all there. Still all there, yeah. So, so it's still um, totally original. As it, as it can, it can be, be as original, it's sort of stuck down, it's getting a bit hard to find, so you have to make do things. So. Fantastic. Let's move on. <laughs> Chris, while you're moving around, I just noticed that that's dangerous. I reckon that colour is suited. Do you think? Yeah, I reckon, I reckon that colour would definitely suit. Oh, it's got more than your colour. Yeah. Well, it's a bit softer, shouldn't it? I wouldn't say no. Hi. Walking to the house. Spock standard 2.5 diesel. Nothing special about it, apart from the fact that I love it. And that's it. it. Yep, absolutely. And the fact that you love it is the important part of it, because that's the whole point of all these cars, we enjoy the vehicles. Um, Dave driver? No, no. Special no. occasions? Yeah, yeah, just a, it's a toy for weekends and just to play with them, be in the club. Put a bit of comfort, put a bit of luxury with it. Absolutely. Oh, why not? Why not? Thank you very much. It's a long line, Oh, yeah. Are you actually going to go to the next one? Have we got all day? Have we got all day? Yeah. Talk about it, then. Run! So we're going to do a bit of a short version here. So tell us a little bit about this bit of a short version. Right, the short version. Right, this car is quite new to us. We saved it from the scrapyard at the beginning of the year. It is a 2.5 DT, but it's been converted. It's got now the M57 TD6 3 litre engine in it. And uh, it's only been on the road now for about 500 miles. We, we actually restore them and fix them up. So this is one that I picked out inside of the team. So this, this, this is your baby now? It is now, and in use every day since he passed his MOT about a month ago. That's the last one right here. Thank you for the I hope so. We'll move on.